but the car is going to drive itself from point A to point B, meaning from you know you know wherever you start to your destination. So uh, that capability is what Tesla has today already and has had for you could argue for at least a year. Um, and I think it's very very likely that Rivian will have that within the next year. Um, I think that's um, that's not only plausible but it's very likely because uh, with the new way of doing uh, full self-driving, meaning like the, the way in which they're training AI um, neural nets to uh, take the bulk of self-driving on, uh, that approach is relatively new and has only been done for less than three years at the most by Tesla. Meaning like if Tesla started from scratch three years ago, they would still be at the same point they are today. So new incumbents uh, or new new companies trying to do the same approach shouldn't be more than three years behind, right? Like uh, if they started today, but Rivian has started, you know, a while back. So they they might be a year or two behind Tesla, but they're not significantly more than that. And by the way, the Rivian vehicles are also collecting uh, data in the same way Tesla vehicles are from every single vehicle they have out there. So uh, that's huge too. 